Good afternoon. Thank you for inviting me to your wonderful conference. My name is Masato Tanaka from Okayama Rosai Hospital. Today, I'd like to share our knowledge about MIS in adult spinal deformity with you. This is 79 years old female adult spinal deformity. You can see very severe malalignment. We have a lot of this kind of elderly patient because in Japan we are now suffering of grain of the society. Today I'd like to talk about these important issues of ASD. First topic is how to reduce the surgical invasiveness. The benefit of surgical intervention for ASD has been reported from the 1970s. However, there were a lot of papers reported a high mortality rate and high complication rate. One good solution is circumferential MIS. If you perform this kind of surgery, long time usage of shear is necessary. This is 65 years, years old female, severe ASD. First stage surgery was lateral approach. Then second surgery was percutaneous pedicle screw fixation. This kind of ASD with fused vertebra. If you look at CAT scan, several vertebra were fused. One solution for this case is asymmetrical PSO. For ankylosing spongylitis, PSO is a good technique. This kind of focal kyphosis, VCR, is necessary. However, three current osteotomy has a risk of massive blood loss. PSO carry a high risk of neurologic injury compared with multiple olive and posterior fusion. Our solution is CM-free navigated osteotomy. Let me show you the video. Now I'm using navigated osteotome. And then this is navigated cup cut the contralateral side of the uh, cortex, then put the cage like this. This is preoperative x-ray. This is post-operative x-ray. Let's move on to the next topic. This paper is AIS cohort study. Because of a lot of spine radiogram, AIS patients have a 4.3% cancer risk. This is five times higher than control group, especially breast cancer and thyroid cancer. All staff also have a radiation risk. If you use CM to put PPS, 
Radiation loads become 0.5 millisievert volt per minute. For us, maximum dose for one year is 100 millisievert. That is 200 min minutes per year for CM usage. You can use CM less than 3.5 hours per year. These dose rate are up to 10 times greater than non-spinal orthopedic procedure. To avoid radiation risk, we embedded shear free technique. The first surgery is five level olive from L1 to S1. Then, one week later, posterior T10 to pelvis fixation, mainly with percutaneous pedicle screw fixation, like this. Let me show you the video. After the draping, first step is to take a bone graft. from posterior iliac crest. After that, take X-ray and CAT scan. This is a registration. Decide the skin incision and then use navigated instrument this is navigated curve. Navigated curet. Navigated trial. And then navigated olive cage. Four centimeter oblique skin incision along the pelvis is made. Then, alongside with skin incision, the abdominal muscles were divided and dissected. After exposing promontory, left common erect vessels are identified and retracted laterally by a blue self-retaining retractor with elimination. The navigated probe is used to check the L5-S1 disk space. A green braid is to retract right side common area vessels. A light blue braid is to retract bifurcation of common area vessels. Now you can see L5-S1 disc very clearly. The annulus is cut with a knife and the disectomy is performed using pituitary forceps. With the navigated pointer, you can confirm the anatomy in a 3D way without CM. This is ring curet. This is a navigated combo tool to make end plate smooth. This is navigated shaver. This is navigated trial.
For only 5 gun cage, size is from 10 to 16 mm. And rhodotic cage angle are 8, 12, 18 degrees. The cage is inserted with a mallet. Second surgery is PPS. SA screw is also inserted by navigation. We perform comparative study. OLIF 51 and TRIF 51. We measured L5 S1 angle and height in both groups, pre op and Post op. Only 5 1 could get better low doses and more disc height compared with TD 5 1. The last topic is how to prevent revision surgery. As you know, PJK has been reported more than 20% of ASD. Sometimes this kind of revision surgery is necessary. This is another case of ASD. These are MRI. To prevent proximal screw backout, we use triangular fixation technique. P11 screw is transdiscal screw and P10 screw is downward. The pull-out strength of transdiscal screw is 1.6 times stronger than normal screw. DJK is also very difficult to revise the surgery. We invented dual SAI screw fixation. According to our comparative study of single and dual SAI screw fixation, SAI screw loosening rate is much less in dual SAI group. Take home message of my talk. CM free OLIF technique is beneficial for patients and spine doctors in terms of radiation problems. Lateral osteotomy for other spinal deformity is one of the best solution for fused lumbar deformity. Triangular fixation and dual SAI are important techniques for upper and lower anchor for adult spinal deformity surgery. CM3 OLIF 51 is a novel technique to create excellent L5-S1 low doses compared with T5-1. Thank you for your attention.